Welcome to Slybazaar's PowerPoint for Pros, a series focused on helping you become better at PowerPoint. In this video, we'll explore how to use and customize layouts in PowerPoint, ensuring your presentations are both visually appealing and functional. Before we begin, I'd like to introduce you to a free tool that can literally 2x your PowerPoint presentation workflow. Check out SlideBazaar's free PowerPoint add-in for templates, themes, charts, icons, and more. The links to the add-in are in the description below. All right, on to the video. Layouts in PowerPoint are pre-designed templates that can provide different arrangements and combinations of image and text placeholders. These layouts allow you to easily add your content and speed up your design creation process, ensuring consistency and professionalism in your presentations. Each layout offers a unique arrangement of text and image placeholders catering to various design needs. Choose the right layout depending on the type of design you aim to create and the visual hierarchy you want to establish. If all of this sounds confusing to you, you do not have to worry since SlideBazaar offers thousands of pre-designed PowerPoint templates that you can edit easily. Check out the links in the description to know more. To begin with using and changing layouts in PowerPoint, go to the Home tab in the PowerPoint ribbon. In the Slides section, you'll find the Layout button. Click on the button and a drop-down menu will appear with all the pre-built layout options PowerPoint offers by default. These layouts feature different placeholder arrangements. Click on the one you need. You can also right-click on the slide in the Overview pane on the left and choose the layout. If you need to revert to the original layout, use the Reset button on the ribbon or press Ctrl plus Z to undo changes. Now if the default layouts do not match your needs, you can always create custom layouts in PowerPoint. To get started, go to the View tab in the PowerPoint ribbon and select Slide Master. In the Slide Master view, find the Edit Master section in the ribbon and select Insert Layout. In the Master Layout section, click on Insert Placeholder. Select and add the placeholders you need in your new layout. Be sure to align and arrange your placeholders well so that your slides look good. To learn more about aligning and arranging objects in PowerPoint, we have a video on the subject which I have linked in the description. Next, right-click on the new layout slide on the left and select Rename Layout to give it a unique name. Once you are done, click on Close Master View. Your new layout will now appear in the Layout drop-down menu for easy access. So that concludes this quick tutorial on using and creating new layouts in PowerPoint. Using layouts helps maintain design consistency across your presentation, making it look professional and cohesive. I hope this video has been helpful. Do not forget to check out SlideBazaar's free PowerPoint add-in to enhance your presentation creation process. The links are in the description. Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.